It's that time again. Show day. I haven't had Harry Bows for about 10 years. A show day poo is an absolute must. God's earth am I doing with your peaks? Plans this week, have you tried to seven months of being on our six months? Besides the McDonald's last night. <laughs> this is a bit weird, me and Gaz in the uh, disabled sort of. First things first, let's talk about facts and works. Your boy at all, match no works. Talk about guns, we on that work. Never. And to make shit worse, I got all five, that's real blood first. He got king, then he got bust. Next outcome game, put in the dirt. Dead boy. How the fuck are they king of this? How? When none of them's king and shit. Pussy. It was me who got hey. man yitch that yitch in front of his bitch. Oh no. Now we glad we bruise that witch. Spot me your up, man's letting it rip. Morning guys, hope you're having a lovely day when you get around to watching this. Show day number two, as you guys know, I won my last qualifier at the UK DFBA short class. Today we are competing at the BMBF Northern up in Manchester as well, so very similar location I think. Meal number two, 100 grams of raw white jasmine rice. There is 50 grams of chicken breast in there. It's not just me eating fucking white rice <laughs> in, in, in a glass tub. You know, there is a little bit of chicken in there, as you can see, only 50 grams. The interesting thing that we've added in is Haribo's. I haven't had Haribo's for about 10 years, and it's not something that I would ever necessarily eat this sort of stuff. But for today's purposes, I've got 60 grams of tan, tan fastics. I can't even, tan fastics? Tantastics, a fuck knows what they're called. I've got 60 grams in there, 20 grams of 90% lint dark chocolate. So that is gonna be on my next meal. I've added a little bit of salt into there. Obviously I've got them, which will be quite interesting for me to eat. And obviously got some dark chocolate as well to hold some fullness. I generally don't know how to feel about eating these. I should be excited, but I'm kind of not. I haven't ate anything different than what you've seen so far on this channel for the past six months. So I'm kind of like, yes, they are nice. I'd rather eat more than what I've got sort of thing. But obviously you've got to do what you've got to do. <laughs> I must admit. <laughs> They're fucking good, man. Oh, food puts a smile on your face. It's so fucked, isn't it? It's fucked in the end. I'm smiling over food. Just eat the fucking food, George, you know? Stop. Competitors, if you know, you know. A show day poo is an absolute must. An absolute must. And you're sitting here watching me shit now. Fantastic day for you. What did you do today? I watched someone have a shit on the show day vlog. That's you. That is you. <laughs> anyway, I'm not going to do that to you. Sorry, guys. But I am going to have a poo, by the way. Bye. Night shift with a fucked up light switch. Grinding on a corporate. And that's my colour. It's the best my colour. Another day in the life of the Georgia boy, just too famous. Ten years, yeah, keep on What on God's earth am I doing with your peaks? Because <laughs> yesterday you had two <laughs> Big Macs, two large fries, vanilla milkshake, and then uh, arrogant. <laughs> <laughs> How many have you got to meet today? Bro, mango Overall, what across? This show and UK FBA, 14. 50 grams of chicken breast, I can't really actually see it. And uh, 100 grams of raw weight jasmine rice, really love, love jasmine rice. So I never used to have jasmine rice before, it's prep until now. I think Jack got me into that. A couple of grains of salt, second half of the, uh, the Harry Bows. Still feel incredibly guilty about eating these, but they are nice. Like the, so the first thing I've had off plan is this week seven months of being on six months. Besides the McDonald's last night. <laughs> <laughs> what I do on my Instagram is I uh, get people thinking, so I put like two Big Macs, two large fries, vanilla milkshake, and people message me like, oh my God, is AJ got you on this car bar? I'm like, yeah, we're, 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 we're too lean, we're too lean. So I get people thinking, and I'm like, oh my God. I don't, I don't really have it. I never would have anything like that. I don't think AJ would ever let it. Most of his competitors are probably copied. Yeah, yeah. Copy, copy the drill. We're gonna eat this now, it's around about 11. I think we predict we're on about, I'd say, half two, something like that. Now, the question is that fly just came out of my uh, sweets. So, better eat them. Sacrifice the wind. 
shit myself on stage now. Will that, will that give me additional... Uh... Oh. <laughs> so I need to basically turn, do a little top. I ain't done my top up yet, and it's pissing down rain this morning. So I just give up. Piss on my leg. One. Oh, I ain't done my second coat yet, so... Oh, I've done the second coat this morning. Yeah, so, yeah. yeah I like to do it close because obviously sweating and sitting down a bit. It fucking... Pissy legs and that. Yeah, piss, so I need to tan. Might have to get one of your boys to help me. This is it with me and guys in the uh, disabled toilets. Fucking putting on tan. Just doing my second coat of tan, because as you can see I've got piss down my leg. <laughs> so, do a tan like the night before, as you saw probably in the previous vlog. And then we do a tan in the morning because it was pissing down the rain. And then we'll stand it like a lemon now, wait for it to dry. Guys, I'm going to have to do my second eye as well when it comes to if it's patchy or not. So there it is.
So, well, because we carved up two weeks ago, when you put a little bit oh, in yeah. after that, it doesn't, it doesn't need much now, does it? You know what I mean? To kind of like, just came off stage. That was uh, hard work. They, they pushed us for a few rounds there, more than what I did last time. I mean, last time I did like court turns, went through the compulsories, and that was it pretty much. And I came off, didn't even move us. So it was good to actually get some stage time because you work so hard and you fucking stand a minute on stage. So, a good five, ten minutes on there. It's so hard to know where you came. Um, obviously, the guy Josh, incredible. He, I knew as soon as I looked back backstage, you kind of know whether you're going to beat someone or not. But was it better than what I was two weeks ago? I would, I would say yes, I was. Is there areas that I can improve on? Yeah, I could definitely be, I think, a little bit fuller. I didn't feel too full on the stage. But this is all data collection. I haven't been on stage for three years, so I was happy with my presentation. I worked really hard with Phoebe this uh, this prep to now presentation on stage instead of just winging it like I did last time. So I'd say I'll be maybe second, third. Not, I just don't know. Could be anywhere from second all the way up to fourth at this point. So that's that. I'm gonna eat some food now because I haven't ate since about half eleven and it's now three o'clock so I'm fucking starving. And then we'll be on for the evening show which will be obviously the posing routine and then getting the results. So wish me luck. Hopefully we've got a second place, I'll be happy with that, I'll be buzzing about that actually. But it, and like I said, it is what it is, it's bodybuilding for you, don't know who turns up on the day and it's some fucking, you get some guys just fucking crazy. Um, and that's what I had today, so, you know, it's nice to be up against people that are bigger, better than me, more competitive, that sort of shit. And I'm just excited to see what I can do for the, uh, for the evening show, but I need some food, I need food and fucking water, that's what I need right now. Okay. We're doing it. So normally I'd weigh ice it to any sort of cream rice just makes it fucking cream of soup. Mrs. Advice is sprinkle a little bit. I'm going to be forever though. It doesn't matter, you're going to enjoy it. That's true. But then all of a sudden I put it all in and just fuck up. Sprinkle a little bit in, stir, and then it should remain the same. Hopefully. I think I'll fuck this. Yeah. Trick to any photos, a Los Angeles filter. That's how I always do it. Oh, it just makes a massive difference. It adds about five pounds of muscle. What I've got to do is wake the fuck up. I've been sitting there about over an hour and a half and I'm fucking yawning my head off. I don't know what's going on, I don't know how I feel, I just need to wake the fuck up. So, I'm too dark, guys. Like, what I've noticed with this tan is. It's dark. Like, what the fuck is going on? Like, compare it to me. Yeah. So, I'm like, yeah. And I've, I've tanned as well. I just generally think I'm just too dark. That's what I noticed when I was on stage as well. I'm a lot darker than when I was... Now, I don't know whether it's because I've been using sunbeds and my skin underneath this is darker when putting it on, it makes it... I don't know if that's a thing. Well, I, I do look okay, but I must admit, like, I'm... I'm not happy with my tan. I don't know whether it's my fault or whether it's just the tan itself. It is what it is at this point. Not much I can do about it, but the thing I'm dreading is taking it off in a fucking shower. Because my hands, 
uh, 5.40 right now, so I reckon I'm going to be on about 7? Probably about 7. So it's going to be a late fucking night. And um, we've been thinking, should I have sushi po after this or should I go back to the Korean rice? What would you do in my situation? I think everyone's going for sushi, right? I'm thinking about it, but I need to earn that sushi. So I said to myself, if I come second today, I'm having sushi. If I don't, I'm going back to the drawing board. I'm going back to cream of rice. Either way, it's a win-win. Yeah, really. you, you won't have sushi. <laughs> you, you won't have sushi. I know. I'll say I have sushi, but I won't. I'm that sort of guy when it comes to the um, shows. I'm all in. I'm like, right, if I'm going on a prep, I'll be fucking sticking to the plan until it's fucking done. However, I am seriously thinking about why the fuck not, i am honest. Why the fuck not? George did say last time if he wins, we'll go for sushi. And he won, and we had a bowl of oats. <laughs> yeah, we did. So we will... <laughs> Says it all. Says we'll it see. all. <laughs> Four weeks, more condition. Yeah, 
Feedback, second, had more size, was for sure heavier than you on stage. The high class here does some more favours compared to weight. First was on his own league, may win the overall. He looked far better at night than he did in the morning. Crispy or fuller, presentation was great. Hope the tan is not still in your eyes. With the lights out condition and fullness, you'll be competitive at both finals. So that was third place at the BMBF Northern. Uh, how do I feel? I feel like shit, as always. When you, when you come third in a, in a qualifier after coming first, you feel, feel a little bit shit. Was I improved from last time? Yes, I guess, hard to say, but I didn't feel improved. Uh, at the end, I was really struggling with my fucking tan in my eyes. I think my tan was too dark, way too dark. I don't know why it was this dark, if anything. I was probably the darkest person on stage throughout the whole fucking night of competitors. So that's something to definitely work upon. And this sort of stuff, you know, I'll fucking drive home and I'll be pissed off about myself. But the main thing is you pick up and you keep going. And, you know, I do this because I absolutely enjoy what I do more than anything and this you know like i always say is just a an added bonus regardless of where i come so yeah a little bit disappointed i wanted to hope i was hoping for second but we've got four weeks to the finals so i'm gonna do i want to do that i want to better myself than where i was today we'll see what happens but i just want to thank everyone that supports the channel i want to thank the missus most importantly for putting up with all my uh all myself uh, i can be a bit of a pain in the ass sometimes and obviously this prep is quite how can we work how can i work this prep is quite taxi on our relationship at times but we've definitely got through it we definitely keep going and uh, I just want to thank you for all your support because it means more than what you know so uh, yeah I'm, I'm gonna be pissed off for the next 24 hours that's for sure but it is what it is I'm not gonna be happy I feel like fucking giving up half the time but I know I shouldn't be in that mindset that's that's me I'm just the extreme person with that mindset I do this because I want to win but I wanted to I wanted to place better today 100% so it is what it is anyway don't forget to like don't forget to subscribe and we'll see you guys in the next one I don't deserve to have a lot of tan right now. I've still got this dreadful tan on my hands. Don't mix two free workouts together. Let's get into the fucking gym. We're driving here. I thought I was going to get fucking mugged. I'm closer to most boys than I am most men. Five seconds up here and I'm looking up to it. No. I'm five for six, right? No one says anything else. We're at Caveman. Two, not one, but two Atlantis pendulums. Don't it, don't it, don't it. Don't it. Man really do trap. Go and fly OT with a batch, come home with something like over a wreck. Save that many vesting weps. Dot spinners, they all.